Hello, my name is Jomar Rodriguez. I am a seventh grader at Solid. In science class, we completed a unit on thermal energy. We learned about how heat transfers. Our unit started off with a problem. Our teacher's iced coffee was warming up on her dry stool. To keep her coffee cold, she tried a cup she bought at the store. We call this a fancy cup. We did a test to see if the fancy cup would work better. It did stop the coffee from warming up as fast as the plain cup. In class, we made a driving question board and created models of each other of each cup system. We developed hypothesis on how the heat was getting to the coffee. We did investigations to try to answer our questions, test our ideas, and update our cup models. We use both ther thermometers and digital temperature probes to collect our data and looked at whether the lid mattered or if the material mattered and if the layers made a difference. We even cut open the cup. The unit ended with a building challenge to build a prototype of an insulated cup that would slow down heat transfer and keep the liquid colder longer than the store-bought fancy cup. We had limited materials and had to address how to limit the three methods of heat transfer, conduction, convection, and radiation. We recorded videos presenting our results. Okay. Hello. Um, so this is my cup. Uh, oops, sorry, not that. Nope, not that. Okay, so this is my cup. This is how it looks. Um, here's a full 360 of the cup. So, yeah, that's that. Uh, this is the um, the drawing of my cup. So, as you can see, I have my the the plastic cup that I already have, and I have my foam sheets, my label, my thick foam, the shiny paper, and the plastic cup. So, yeah. <laughs> Uh, so the thick foam uh, helps stop the cup and water from being heated by directly contacting the table and my hand stops the heat transferring by conduction. The lid stops the water be from being heated by moving hot and cold air particles and stops heat transfer by convection. The shiny paper stops the water from being heated by light waves and stops heat and stops heat transfer by radiation. Um, my test results for the change in the fancy cup was seven degrees Celsius, and the change for my cup was one degree Celsius. This shows that my cup works better than the fancy cup. Uh, if I could rebuild my insulated cup, I would get a bigger cup to fit the smaller cup inside, and in between the small cup, I would put styrofoam I would put more styrofoam and shiny paper so I could have more layers. And that was it.